this video I'm going to talk about page breaks. Have you ever had one of those I mean, experiences where you're typing away at your paper, um, you already have inserted your works cited page into it, so you're working on the body of your paper, and you scroll down, and all of a sudden your works cited page, which used to be up here, perfectly formatted, ready to go, is all of a sudden down here in the middle of the page. As you type up here, as you change stuff up here, the works cited moves itself down. Or, say maybe you deleted a paragraph up here, and all of a sudden it's bumped up to uh, the page in front of it. Not real great when you're turning in a paper, right? Especially if you're making some last minute changes, um, you're in a hurry, you have to print and take it into class to turn in. So, how do we avoid this from happening? Well, page grip page breaks can help us with that. So let's bring this up actually to the the, um, the page ahead. And what we're going to do is we're going to put our cursor at the beginning of the first line of um, the page that we want to separate. And if we go up to insert, and I'm actually using um, Word for Mac, but if you go to insert, break, page break, it will bump everything below your cursor down to the next page. So no matter how many times you do stuff, you enter crazy stuff, actually let's copy this and I'll show you. So no matter how much stuff you put here, you're always going to have the work cited bump down to the next page. So you're not going to worry about, you're not going to have to worry about it ever. Uh, getting too close to the rest of your paper or completely losing formatting.